happy Monday, or whenever you're watching this, it's Monday when I'm filming it. <laughs> um, so I did something bad. I napped today. I got done with work at five, and I never, I know not to get in bed after five. I know it. And I did it anyway, and it took like an hour and 15 minute nap. Come on, Mo. Um, so I'm about to start making dinner, and then I'm gonna work out because your girl had stopped. I got too busy to like really do a lot of weightlifting every single day, and it's not worth it if you, what is he doing? My husband just pulled the driveway and he's just sitting there, I think he's checking the mail. Um, it's not worth weightlifting if you're gonna weightlift like once in a blue moon because then it doesn't have the effect. So I was like, okay, it's just easier to eat right than it is to work out because I couldn't find the time. And what do you know, your girl stopped losing weight. <laughs> so um, if you guys don't know, I have like some ch uh, videos up on that about my main channel. I know what a healthy weight is for my body, for my height, for uh, my age, and I'm not there. So we're working on that. And also, I mean, it's almost summer. Who doesn't want a summer bod, right? I got a lot of bikini stuff I got to be in this this year. Um, a lot of beach trips, a lot of lake trips. So, <sighs> my husband just got home. I'm going to make dinner. I'm not going to sleep well tonight. Allie, get down. You big lug, you're so big. Have you started dinner? No, oh. I just saw no, your text. No, you're fine, you're fine. I just saw your text message. I'm sorry. No, was no, just yet. Why? Why? What plans are you making? What are you doing? Where are you going? Huh? You're going to play soccer, aren't you? Maybe. Can you kiss? You said something about working out, and so then I was like, yeah. oh, I have to go for a run. I like kissing teeth. Um, so the boys just totally shit the bed right there at the end. What in the world happened? <sighs> So, change of plans. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw or heard that conversation or if I edited it out. I don't know. Um, I ended up, so I ended up um, deciding to work out. Sam went and played soccer, and then I'm going to cook dinner now. So, making busketti. This is good. Okay, I'm going to time lapse dinner now. guys I'm so exhausted so I'm home from work I just finished up the bid one of the biggest things one of the biggest projects I think I've ever worked on but it's finished and I came home and I have to clean my house because my husband did not do it today <sighs> it's fine but I got a really exciting package my camera's here my vlog camera I'm so excited so it along with one other thing came in so I'm gonna open that with you guys now. Okay, I'm so excited that this came in. Allie, can you get, get down? Okay, so there's a bunch of crap on my counter. Um, but we're gonna just run with it. So the first thing I wanna open, I'm trying to make sure that none of my like addresses show in any of this. So the first thing is actually makeup. So I ordered this. Sunday, I think, and I've told you guys, like, I have the worst luck when it comes to, um, like, shipping. I cannot get shipping together. Oh, that color is too light. That color is, well, maybe not. Maybe it's not. Um, but I have the worst luck with shipping. I accidentally put a nine at the end of my address when it's supposed to be a and, um, I oh, know they did change it and I messaged them and I was like, I'm so sorry, but they ended up getting it changed. So I ordered the e.l.f. Flawless Finish Foundation in the color Snow. I just went off of the online. Let's see if this is like what it is. Oh my gosh. Oh. Ha! <laughs> All right. I'm being real dramatic. Let's see what the color is. So sometimes when 
I say that I have like a pink t undertone to my skin, which is what this says is good for. It sometimes comes out orange. Let's see. <gasps> no, that's perfect. Okay, well, it looks a little light, but I, I can already tell that's perfect. <gasps> Yay! Okay, so that's the first thing I bought. I'm super excited to try it out because if I like it, you guys, that is a $6 foundation. It feels super creamy. Oh, I'm excited. Okay. So then next I bought the e.l.f. brow pencil. I bought it in the color taupe because sometimes that works with my red hair. Let's see if it has. And then I got the 16 hour camo concealer in the color fair beige, which is the exact color or maybe it's light beige that I wear in a Tarte Shape Tape. But people have said this compares to it. Which is like unreal because it is like $5 I think. Oh my gosh, that is good. That is good. You cannot feel the thickness. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. So I'll let you guys know in the description bar below how I feel about these because I will have already worn them by the time this video goes live. So I love that. Love trying new stuff, especially if it's affordable. I'm so excited about my camera. Alright, let's do this. So when I bought my Rebel T6, I bought it in like a set, so I don't know if you guys can see, there's like a ton of stuff down in here. And it, like, I bought it on Amazon, so I bought this one as a set as well. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh, I'm so happy. Look. So I got the Canon G7X Mark II. I'm so excited. So this is new, like brand new. I did not want to buy a used one, a gently used, refurbished, none of that. Because when it comes to cameras, I just get super antsy that I'm going to pay a bunch of money and it's not going to be nice. So I have to play around with it. But I'm, oh my gosh, I can already tell how little it is. Look, you guys, look how little. So let me compare it. Ah! So th this is my Canon Rebel T6. This is my Canon G7X Mark II. Like, look at the difference just in this camera. Like, this is technically a small camera compared to the, some of the other DSLRs out there, or just, I guess, compared to DSLR in general. But the reason that I wanted this one was because of this feature, and I hope I did not. Oh. I obviously need to like play around. Oh. I obviously need to play around a little bit, but that is the biggest thing is because when I vlog, I wanna be able to see myself, and with my Nikon that I use for my wedding week vlogs, I could not see anything, so I was so hesitant to vlog. But that is so so I have two different tripods, one that you guys are sitting on now, and then this one that I use pretty regularly. The only reason I don't like this one as much is because it's not as easy to adjust. So there you can just kind of see like this is what it will look like when I'm vlogging. Like that. Okay. So I really need to just like sit down and play with this. And then I need to clean and edit some vlogs. So I probably need to like really just get off of here and get to doing that type of stuff. But I'm so excited. So I'll show you what else is in here. I got a um, camera bag. Also came with the set. This is the cutest little camera bag. Look how little it is. Oh my god. It's so tiny. Look how little. <laughs> and then, which I actually really like because that is going to be so easy when I'm like traveling to be able to still protect it, but not have to like carry a big bag. So that is awesome. I don't know how, like I, why I thought it was gonna be bigger, but it's got a little strap, which we are going to be putting on because I have the dropsies all the time. A battery and a battery charger. I don't think, no, this is, okay. I'm gonna probably need another battery. 
hopefully I can finish out my vlog on this camera. So you'll have to excuse the video quality in the next few snaps um, if it's not the best. But if I screw it all up, then, well, you guys are family. You ain't gonna judge me, right? Whoa, look at that video quality. Is that like so crazy? So I'm looking a little yellow. I'm still trying to figure out how to like set everything to work because so like this is an extremely yellow light in my bedroom. And then when I go into my office, it's a very blue light. I don't know, maybe I'll just, maybe I'm like envisioning it, but it's gonna be super hard to look at you guys and not at the camera screen above because otherwise, like I catch myself doing that a lot in general when I'm vlogging, but look at the video quality. I think you can see it a little bit better when there's like more behind me. You can really see the, so see it's very blue in here. But so let's do this. It's like you can see like how it focuses on me versus what's behind me so it really makes everything blurred which is super cool the only unfortunate thing is now it's a very clear image so it shows all of my imperfections but that's okay because we all got them um i'm about to sit down i'm really gonna like get through this book i really need to clean my freaking house i ended up i went to hang out with my mom like it always happens i'll go down to see my mom and i'll be down there for like three hours so we ended up going to dinner and we're just, we always cut up the two of us. We literally had appointments today with the gynecologist. We go to the same gynecologist. We had them right after each other. Like I literally ran into my mother today at the gyno. It's hilarious. But um, that was probably TMI. But I, I go and I hang out with my mom and I just love hanging out with her. And so I've been gone for like two and a half, three hours. I haven't cleaned, haven't done the first thing so I'm gonna try to like kind of play with the time-lapse feature on this camera and clean up this house because y'all it is so bad but I love the video quality I'm so excited I finally got a vlog camera <laughs> all right so I think I figured out how to do the time-lapse feature I'm not entirely sure but I am gonna change some clothes and I guess I'll just try and vlog as much as possible so I'm in my bathroom now. Let's see if it adjusts. Oh, look at that. So beautiful. I have never been able to vlog in my bathroom, my messy bathroom, because every time that I do, it's too dark. So let's see where I can prop you guys up. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. We will make it work. That's very, very faint. Okay, so I am going to try and do my hair so I don't have to do it again for the rest of the night. Um... I don't know if you guys can hear the fan, how loud it is, but we're just running with it tonight, trying to play with this camera as much as possible. So, I don't know if I've ever told you guys. Probably need to start a little closer. I braid my hair sometimes. Like, whenever I'm curling my hair and I'm trying to keep it uh, with like the curl lasting a little bit longer and my hair not getting dirty, I'll braid my hair. My husband hates when I braid my hair because he can't play with it. But I've noticed that like, I don't know. I don't know if it's the shampoo or conditioner or something, but whenever I don't put conditioner in the roots of my hair, it's like my hair gets dirty faster. It's very strange. So I'm kind of having a, I'm gonna have to change up my shampoo and conditioner here soon. My hair just, your hair changes, you know, just like, your skin changes every now and then, your hair changes too, and I think it's just time for me to change up my hair products. So, hair's been getting a little bit greasy a little fast, so I braid my hair at nighttime. Because one, it keeps my husband's hands out of it, which makes it worse, because he likes to play with the roots of my hair. And it also just helps kind of keep the wave. Now, I will recurl my hair in the morning times, like I have literally have my curling iron right here from when I curled, recurled it this morning. Um, so I'll recurl it tomorrow, but this just kind of keeps it from looking a hot mess. So that's a small little tip for you ladies. And then pull it around. taken off any I don't know who I am I have not taken off any of my jewelry today still wearing my hoops like 
Usually I come home and the first thing I do is take off all my friggin' work clothes. Cause I like, like work clothes, they make me, ah, oh, dang. Big old chunk of hair back here that I missed. Um, I like my work clothes, but I like being comfy more and So we gotta do this. And I do just have a French braid. French, I don't think the regular braids work. Only, at least for my hair, only French braids work in this concept I can like regular braid my hair but you gotta French braid it if you want it to last with this old main okay and then I will just pull pieces like this because if I don't it never fails I get a raging headache so I pull some of the pieces up just to kind of because it's a mess and then I'll just pull this down because well I don't know, I'm weird, and I always like reach for that. So if at least I have pieces of hair pulled down, <laughs> my husband wants something to play with. All right, now I seriously, I've got to start cleaning. Stay focus. Okay. All right, guys. So I'm not quite sure what of that turned out, but um, Sam is home now. So I'm going to get in the shower and call it a night. Okay, babe. I'm trying to close out my vlog here. If you could stop playing soccer in the house, that'd be great. I'm going to um, close out the vlog here and call it a night because I got a lot of work to do. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to go below and click the subscribe button if you're new here. So grateful for you guys. It's because of you that this camera happened. Love you, and I'll see you in my next vlog.